Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Ender Lilies. Last time we left off, we made a lot of progress, I like to think. Made our way up here, left some areas still unexplored, but um, we can't access some of those yet, so let's just go. Seems a path leads off from here, shall we take a look? Sounds like a good idea to me. Ah, this is cool, how the map is kind of set up here. It branches off in different directions by, uh, going, like, through a gate and stuff like that. I was thinking we were just gonna be going left or right the most of the time, but no, we can go, like, up and back that way. This is probably gonna be a very massive map, now that I think about it. Maybe not quite as big as Astalon, but still pretty big. I think. Definitely not as big as Hollow Knight. Hollow Knight is just, uh, ridiculously massive. Uh-huh, eat it. Ooh, that thing does 114 damage now. Oh boy. Alright, I'm gonna try to be... Yeah, there we go. Sneaksy doodle against you. Boom. Just dash right behind your back and stab you. Nothing personnel, kid. Uh, nope. I'm gonna kill you first because you're annoying. Ow. Tried to jump out of the way there. Eat it. Gotcha. Uh, bird, you good? You're kind of stuck in here, just flying into the wall. Thought that guy was gonna die faster. Whew. Gotta watch that attack, man. That attack's spooky. I'm very proud of the fact that I haven't died yet, though. Um, the game doesn't seem too hard for the most part, but I am still in the intro areas, so I gotta keep that in mind. Bing, bing. There we go. I die, die. Gotcha. Uh, I tried to double jump there. But my input flubbed. Nope. Can't reach you. Not quite. Uh, there's a lot of you birds, huh? I can't reach most of you. Die. Whoa, you look different. Uh, sure. Open that up. Whatever it is. Hi, friend. Hi, friend. Yeah, you look spooky. I don't know about you. Um, let's toss that, use that. There we go, that was a pretty good way of handling- OH MY GOD! Okay, whew, we almost died there. That stuff did a lot of damage. Would you- Go away. Ah, god. Annoying idiots. Alright, I'm coming back for you, don't you worry. Ooh, an amulet fragment. Yes! Thank you. More HP. Ugh, my, my jump keeps getting flubbed there. I don't know why that keeps happening to me. Uh, come on. There you go. You two, do your little jump. Here we go. Your easy pickings once you do. Come on. Come on. You know you want to. Yeah, there we go. Good slug, jumping straight to your death. That looks like it'll hurt me. Save me from this darkness. Bathe me in tranquil light. Filthy residue shed by purified blighted. The sorrowful muck is stagnant. Yeah, so these are purified blighted, so... Um, some other white priestess? Or a previous white priest? Oh, wait, no, it's- we're purifying them. They're like down and then we purify them and we get the stuff. Yeah. Ah! Oh god! Okay, that thing knocked me right into the water. That was kind of scary. Oh, hi. Ugh. Okay, we're good. We're good. Uh-huh. Bye. I see something up there hanging out. What is that? Oh. Hi. Mm-hmm. And what are you doing, friends? Oh, we're back here at the beginning now. Uh-huh. Well, that's interesting. Yeah. I think this is the beginning, right? Because that was that- Oh no, I killed that guy. Yeah, that guy's dead. Maybe this isn't the spot I was thinking of. Let's walk back this way. What's over here? Looks like it leads out of here. Yeah, maybe you are back at the beginning. I just never saw that area, or that guy respawns. Yeah, because none of the enemies are back over here. 
Okay, I just want to go check back over here because it says there's another path I can take. And I really want that. But I don't seem to be able to get it. Not right now. Can I go in there? Oh, I can! This is the area. Okay, I totally missed this. Die, bird. Oh! Western merchant. Ow. Uh-huh. Eat it. Uh-huh. Big damage. Yeah, break your guard. Gotcha. Alright, and you're gonna- you're a new spirit, right? If only I could see my wife and daughter one last time. I will pur purify you, friend. This is like a weird monster collection game, too. I did not expect that. That's super cool. Summons the spirit of the western merchant who launches ranged, ranged attacks at enemies on sight. The merchant from a western land came to Land's End peddling foreign wares. A vibrant salesman who would light up when touting his rare stock. No. Oh, sad, man. But hey, I got a cool new, uh... <laughs> I got a cool new Pokemon spirit. Or stand power. Stando. Alright, so yeah, now let's go back this way. There is still a chest here. Which I can come back for later, once I get, like, the high jump ability. At least it actually marks on the map what areas I haven't gotten everything in, so it'll be easy to remember what to go back to. I like that, actually. That's a good way of doing it, just showing you if a room isn't completed or not. Um, I still prefer, I think, the Hollow Knight way of doing it, where it's like you get these little symbols you can just pin to your map. That I thought that was such a cool system. I love when games do that. Letting you kind of mark up your map. It's very neat. Alright, where does this go? Over this way. Boom, boom, boom. Wow, that thing curved and hit me. Uh... You guys just wait until I get that, uh, that new- my new Pokemon on. Actually, maybe I should- yeah, we should go heal at the thingy. I'm a, I'm a fool for not doing that. I'm a fool. Yeah, this chair. Alright, cool. So, we got a new spirit. Um, you. 50 uses. And a cooldown 1. Launches at enemies in sight. Yeah. Uh, I think I'll put you over Sigrid, maybe? We'll give that a shot. And, um, just in case, we'll put Sigrid here and you there as our alt. So, we can give them both a shot. Okay, it seems like you do only shoot if enemies are around. Interesting. Oh, and you have 50 shots, because I can summon you for free, but then you have 50 shots after that. Interesting. So if I summon you right now... Oh yeah, that's not bad. You don't do the most damage, but you're useful at hitting enemies that I can't access. So I like that. Cool, cool. This is a very neat game so far. Bye. Noid. Alright, so... Let's see here. Boom, boom. And up. Uh, oh, jeez. That's not what I meant to do. Let's take out the archers first. Okay, you're not hitting me with that, idiot. Uh, boom. Boom. Okay, let's let's send you away. This is probably the best way to take care of this guy. Just toss our little uh, our ch our children at it. <laughs> My child. There you go. <laughs> it's so dark. All right. There's another one of those things we can break through. It looks like. Uh ha. Aha! Too slow with that bow. All right. Where does this take me? Because I notice I can get onto this roof. Ooh, amulet fragment, thank you. Big ol' HP bar, look at us. All right, now we drop back down here and go through here. Yeah, we could go there, that's another way to go. Mm. Nope, oh, there's a lot of enemies here, actually. Oh my god, the screen is just full of them. 
All right, bird, come out. I'm gonna need your assistance here. I think. Ow! Ooh. Heal. Okay, we're good. Go away, bird. Thank you for your help. Mm -hmm. There we go. And boom, boom. Yeah, the combat feels really satisfying. I like it quite a bit, actually. There we go. Ow! Ow. I walked right into that. Die. Thank you. Yeah, they just vomited enemies all over the place here, man. Ah, there's a ton. But hey, I'm getting a lot of XP. That's a nice way to look at it. <laughs> well, except for the fact that these all used to be people that I'm killing, but... <laughs> Let's try not to think about it. Uh-huh. Doing your thing. We can't miss those. Uh, preferably... Can't be missing those. Ooh! You have a shockwave attack! Oh god. Uh. Okay. Hit you. I think we should be able to take you out now. There we go. Alright, you guys are up here flailing around at nothing. Jeez. Is this really all you guys get to do all day? Huh? This is it? Alright, what's up here? Just a switch? Just a switch. Alright, I wanted to jump to see if there was anything hidden over there, but sadly, there was not. Okay, so that opened this gate right here. Ow! Ugh. Okay. Bird, I need you. Thank you. No, you're not getting me with that. Ugh. Ugh. Die. Thank you. Whew. Level up. I'm really low on HP, though. I gotta be careful here. Is that more HP? No, that's just spirit. I mean, that's still good, too. I needed a refill. Uh, I can't quite jump that high. Hmm. I don't suppose I could do one of these. No. Alright, I don't think I can get that. Not right now. All right, down here, maybe? Okay, there's two different paths we can take. We can go down or we can go up. I'm gonna go up first, because we don't have the swimming ability, and I imagine that's probably a recommended ability to have in the uh, area with water. Boom, boom. Mm-mm. Bad wolf. Ooh, ah, I tried to dodge. Couldn't do it in time. Uh-huh. Ah. Eat it, nerd. Dead. Whoo, we need a heal. That's what we need. There we go. Oh, great priestess, I beg of you. I will. Filthy residue, yep. Stagnant blight. So people are actually begging us to purify them when we come by. Kind of sad. Well, very sad. It makes sense. They have to, like, suffer, like... It seems like it's a kind of zombie apocalypse scenario where they still have a bit of themselves, they just can't control their bodies anymore. Which is even more sad. Because that's the thing you never want to think about in zombie fiction is, is there still a little bit of them left? And it seems like here there is. They can see what they're doing. Grants an additional relic slot. Yes. Magical chain that links with the power contained in a relic. Thank you. We want to make sure we get all of those. Okay, well, I can't make it up there. We've made quite a bit of progress on the map, but as we can see, the map can move... ...very far. <laughs> like, oh my god, I hope this entire I hope the map doesn't fill out this entire screen at some point. That'd be insane, man! Maybe this map is bigger than Astalon's. That would be ridiculous. Hamlet Request 1. Request. Fearless warrior needed to slay large monsters in the forest. Monsters have settled in the forest near the hamlet, wounding many of the king's soldiers. Rewards will be given for any of the fiends killed. Stand with us and protect our great nation. Knight of the Bastion, Heimel. Alright. Let's go back this way. What's down here? Okay, this place that connects these two. 
I'm just coming at it from the backside, so I can kill all of you much easier. I have a much better time with this. Ooh. Oh, okay, that's just a heal. I thought that was a an item. Die, doggy. Sorry. Uh -huh. Nope. I'm hitting you with that. Uh-uh. Ow! That was some DiMaggio. Anything in here? Ooh, secret. Yes! Secret amulet fragments. Gotta always rub your face on those walls, man. It's the years of JRPGs and Metroidvanias that have taught me if there's a wall, rub your face on it. Because there might be something cool. Die, die. No, you don't. Die, die, die. Give me this. Cool. I need that. I'm gonna wait to heal. Because uh, I'm hoping it'll uh, heal me more if I wait. Alright. And now, yeah, we're just going this way. Um, it says there's still some stuff on the screen, but I imagine that's just probably at the bottom of this uh, water right here. Probably. Maybe there's something on top of that roof. I can't get on top of the roof. Yeah, this- Oh my god, hello! What? How did I walk past you before? I don't know if I'm gonna be able to beat you with the amount of HP I have, friend. Ow. Uh, bang. Uh. Mm, ow! Uh, heal. This is gonna be my first time dying, possibly. Okay, no, that was ri that's risky. You don't go in there now. Come on, do an attack. Ow, my god. Yes, we barely got him. Whew. I decided to risk it for the biscuit there. Oh, man. Given the choice, I'd rather have lost my mind than this. So some of them have different opinions about being purified, I guess. Headless Defender. A knight with a shield at the ready. Well-timed blocks will counter enemies, leaving them stunned and vulnerable. We get a parry. Okay. A knight who followed in the footsteps of the hero, Jared. Suffering the blight upon becoming immortal took its toll. He was beheaded for attacking his fellow knights. Mm-hmm. Knight with shield at the ready. Wow, I can't believe we have like a parry. That's awesome. I'm into that for sure. Okay, we seems like we can go up here too. Hmm. Ah, yeah, that's what I saw coming in. Okay. So that's what that was. Cool. There is a uh, bench over here. If I should have, I, I should have paid attention to the map and saw that there was one uh, over here and used it. If we had just kept walking to the right, I might have been able to get it. Read. It is at the White Parish grounds in the catacombs where the Guardian candidates endure many years of training. They toil to fortify their bodies and minds to be deemed worthy of protecting the White Priestess. Selected from devotees of the church, it is said that only the ten finest candidates will earn that honor. And, uh, what was, it, what was her name? Um... Sieg... Sieg... Uh, Siegfried, Sieg, I don't know. Sieg something, right? Spirits. Uh, Sigrid. Sigrid. Knight with shield at the ready. Well timed blocks will counter enemies, leaving them stunned and vulnerable. I mean, I want to use this. I'm not usually super great at parries, and I'm kind of really set on what I got right now, but I'll put it over that. And for boss fights, maybe we can use that. I should probably give it some attempts now, though. Um, just to see how good I am with it, or if it's even worth, um, pursuing. I imagine it'll be very good against bosses, right? Like this guy right here. Jared, the Elder Warrior. Uh. Uh, I tried the block there. I tried again, I think. Come on. 
Uh, okay, I'm very bad at this apparently. Maybe we maybe we shouldn't mess with that right now. Okay, there we go. I got it that time. I did a pretty good amount of damage, but not worth how much I took to actually pull it off. Mm. Okay, that wasn't bad. Oh. Ah, I tried to get it out. I couldn't in time. Alright, we gotta be safe here. Let's try and stay away from them a little bit and toss some of these your way. Ooh, that was good. That was a good parry. That was very good. Okay, now you're powered up. Yup. Okay, we're good. Just keep hitting them with those. Okay, I tried. That's the shockwave. Okay, just don't take damage. And we're good. You still have a lot of HP, I would like to point out. Wail on you with these things. Oh, that was a bad call. Okay, we're good. Ooh, that was nice. But I got stuck inside your body and took a little bit of damage. Okay, we're good though. What are you doing? Okay, you knocked me away. Huh. Huh. Okay. Oh, you got me with the backswing. Uh. Ow. Okay. Getting a bit spooky here, man. Oh, that was a bad call. Damn it. Okay. Okay. I can do that though. I can do that though. That guy's not that bad. Not that bad at all. Um, and I'll be better with my parries this time, I like to think. So, yeah. We, we got this. That was my first time dying and I still think I did pretty well against the boss. Hey friends. Boom, boom, boom. You don't. Eat it. Okay, I gotta make sure I don't get stuck in their body when I do that, though. Uh-huh. Seems like dodging is just better than parrying, though. Like, look at this. It does more damage. Yeah, the parry might not be the way to go here. It's probably a good panic button, I guess. But, uh... Otherwise, might not be totally worth it. Ow. Okay, that was my bad. I once again got stuck in their body. Okay, no, actually not crazy about the parry. It seems better, like, to just dodge through them rather than worry about parrying them. So, let's get- let's- let's drop that, actually. Um, and we'll use the, uh, we'll use the other thing. And I can also enhance, which I didn't do. Um, so, I think I want that thing, right? I think I'm gonna upgrade you. The Western Merchant, you'd probably be pretty useful in this fight, right? Yeah, we'll go with that. Alright. I like having difficulty with the bosses, though. That is, uh, always fun. Alright, let's go ahead and get you out. Yeah, you're gonna roar. Okay, yeah, Bird's doing just a little bit of, uh, extra damage in here. Uh-huh. Yup. Bang, bang, bang. Uh-uh. Okay, you're... yeah. You were immune to damage right there. Boom, boom, boom. Uh-uh. Nothing. You got nothing on me. Boom, boom, boom. Ow. Okay, yeah, this is going way better when I'm not trying to do the parry. The parry's cool, and I do always like parries in games, but that one just doesn't seem like it's super worth it right now. It just feels better to use other things. 
Ow. Ow. Okay, don't die. Cool, we're good. Mm-hmm. Bing, bing. Die, Jared, die! Help. Ugh, get out of there! Ugh. Okay, we got it. Out. They okay, played a little bit safe. We're gonna we're gonna lame it out here. Huh. Uh huh. That would have been a really good opportunity to get some damage in on you, actually. Okay, one more, and then we can get some hits in. Boom. Dunzo. Out of here, Jared. Gerard, whatever you want to call yourself. The blighted scum, how could they? How dare they? Out of here, friend. Be purified. I hear the muffled voices of the villagers outside my shack. They fear what I have become upon my return from the fortress battle. I chose to become an immortal knight to protect them all. There are days I wish I could be purified, but... The priestess of the fount must not be made to carry that burden any longer. After some time, I hear voices again. But this time, they belong to the white priestess and a child. The priestess, once but a child herself, now cuts a radiant figure. I no longer know the pleasures of joy, but despite this, my cheeks widen in a grin. When madness takes me, will this little one be made to carry the burden? I don't know how long my consciousness will hold out. But as long as I am myself, I will be a shield to protect them from harm. The pain I will endure is nothing compared to their suffering. So yeah, it seems like they're made immortal knights so that they can protect people, but they slowly lose their mind over the over the time of being immortal, which makes sense, because if you were immortal, I feel like you would slowly start to lose your mind. Jared, the Elder Warrior, swings a heavy, powerful hammer slowly, but with force and range enough to blow enemies away. A giant of a man, once dubbed the finest knight in the kingdom, he was a symbol of glory and a hero to his village. His altruism made his demise a lonely one. While airborne. Oh, down X. Elder Warrior Jared dives and unleashes a shockwave upon landing. Can break pustulant ground. The greater the height, the more powerful the shockwave. Try leaping up and can perform a dive attack with Jared. Yes. The impact of the dive can break through pustulant ground and penetrable by normal attacks. Some pustules are tougher than others and can only be broken from diving high. Thank you. We got that. He protected the village to the very end. Brave warrior indeed. Also, he's got a sick hammer attack that I'm ready to try. That was you and your mother. Did you often visit with her? Boom! Big hammer! I like it. I like it. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Let's go ahead and sit on uh, the bed here. That is probably very wet, I would say. Alright, yeah, so I'm not crazy about the Headless Defender. It's neat, but, um, I don't know. Oh, and this is a new main skill. Hmm, hmm. That's interesting. I thought it was just gonna be another spirit. Oh, whoopsie. Didn't mean to do that. Okay, so it's big damage, but it also knocks enemies away. Okay, that's interesting. That might be too slow for me to use, in all honesty. Depends on how much damage it does. I usually like faster weapons in these types of games. But it's cool that that is an option. And we'll we'll leave it on for that reason and that reason alone. I might stick with the Umbral Knight, though. 
and we can't enhance... Okay, we didn't get one of the things we need to enhance you guys. Oh, wait, no. We, we have what we need for you. Furious Blight. Which I think is the stuff we've been getting from, like, boxes? Um, or maybe it's what we got from boss fights or something. But we need an Ancient Soul to upgrade the Umbral Knight. Okay. Oh, and toggle information. Yeah. Okay, that's neat. Well, with that, I think we're going to go ahead and end this episode off here. I hope you have enjoyed... Oh, wait. Can we uh, equip a new relic? Yeah, we can. Uh... Probably this one. Yeah. Alright, and with that, I think we're going to go ahead and end this episode of Ender Lilies off here. I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.